climate change is happening, it's affecting the poorest countries in the world and we want to understand how it affects people in those countries and what can we do to help them adjust. How developing countries can cope with climate change, in particular workers in agriculture that face bad weather conditions and droughts, whether you know, they lose their jobs in agriculture and where they can find jobs. We compare regions in Brazil that are subject to different levels of drought conditions and use this comparison across regions to understand what is the causal effect of these changes in climate on movements of people across sectors. We find that extreme drought conditions uh, generate a large uh, reduction in agricultural employment and these former agricultural workers partly find jobs in the local manufacturing sector and partly have to live and find jobs in other areas. Uh, the main impediment uh, we find for these uh, workers is that they do not have a labor market connections in these faraway areas. So when they go there, they end up finding jobs in agricultural services, but they are unable to find jobs in the manufacturing sector, which uh, pays uh, higher wages and has better uh, you know, long-run uh, growth prospects. The key takeaway is that uh, climate change is a large shock, larger than we would expect if we think of shocks that we have experienced in the past, like international trade shocks, in that it generates larger uh, movements of people. At the same time, these uh, displaced people seem to have a hard time finding high quality jobs at destination. Uh, so this requires that we think of mechanisms of helping people make this change.